Welcome to another bespoke build for Tran Engineering. This one we're going to call the Mokusoka fat tanker with a huge fat pump and engine for running. So basically, we've got split tank made all of stainless steel. It's got a 700 litre dirty side and a 300 litre clean side. Now, what's powering this fat pump is a 20 horsepower. Honda GX630 electric start and it's going to power a mech 6,500 vac pump which is going to create about 7,000 litres a minute of air expressing out of a 700 litre tank so that should give you plenty of suction power we're going to demonstrate that in a little while let me just show you around the chassis first so we've got a 2,800 kg gross chassis single axle it's on Land Rover style wheels, heavy duty chassis. So we've got the fuel tank for feeding the Honda GX630. You've got a wash down facility. So let me show you how that works. So we've got an on off switch around the side. And then it's an on demand 12 volt pump. So we need to clean down after we've finished little clean down facility just for washing down just clean down your hoses or whatever so this customer's asked for an incredible 75 meters of tiger tail hose so it comes in 50 meter coils and then we've got quick release connectors so we can extend the hose or reduce the hose to whatever size we need for the application of the day i say total length on this job is 75 meters so safety features We've got a primary overfill protection, a secondary overfill protection, and then we've got a pressure clock to tell you how much pressure you're creating. There is a vacuum relief valve on the top of the tank, and there's a pressure relief valve in the MEC 6500. Also, we have added a four inch filler there. So basically, if you need to clean out your tank, make it easy, take the filler cap off, Put your pressure washer in, you can pressure washer out the contents that's in the tank, makes it a little bit easier for cleaning. But when you want to discharge the dirty side of the tank, you've got a manhole there. I say this job's all stainless steel, so stainless steel manhole that's clamped under the clamps, open the door, and you can scrape the contents out if they don't come out via the four inch outlet that's in the base of the tank. So we've got a four inch outlet there in the base of the tank with a on off valve that will just empty your contents. So most of the time you'll be pressure washer at the top, empty the contents through that. Anything that gets stuck, you've always got the man lid that you can open and scrape the contents out. Okay, let's follow it up and see this work. Start the procedures nice and easy. If it's cold, pull your choke out to, for starting. Move up to there, and then it's just a case of fire it over. Let's fire it up. At the moment, we've got about 30 meters of hose on. Let's see what happens. <laughs> 